starting with the name of Allah Almighty, who is the master of the day of judgment, and a bundle of the Rudra Salaam and beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wasallam. Dear students, Mathematics, Exercise 13C, New Syllabus Mathematics D3, for all level A level students. And question number 2 is, in each case, who is the center of the circle? Find the value of unknown. So it is a circle. And who is the center of this circle? And we have to find the value of A. So student, first we, I will give the name of the points as A, B and C. Students, A, O, C is the diameter, means it is semicircle and angle A, B, C is an angle on semicircle. So angle B is right angle because it is on the semicircle. And this angle, angle, uh, straight angle A, O, C is 180 degree and it is the central angle. So the circum angle is half of the central angle. So angle B is of 90 degree. And we have to find the value of A. So in right angle triangle, some of the acute angles will be 90 degree. And in this way, we will find the value of A. We can apply the formula sum of angles in a triangle is equal to 180 degree as well. And it is uh, very easy for us, us just to write sum of acute angle in right angle triangle is equal to 90 degree. So I will apply this formula. Sum of acute angles, sum of acute angles in right angle triangle is equal to 90 degree. So this angle is 40 degree and other acute angle is A that is equal to 90 degree and we have to find the value of A so we will transfer this 40 to other side and it will become minus so the value of A will be 90 degree minus 40 degree and the value of A is 50 degree. Students in B part there is a circle with center O and we have to find this angle B. First I will name the points as A, B and C and in given a, B and B, C are congruent and angle B is right angle because it is on the semicircle and it is half of supplementary angle that is 180 so this angle is right angle and we have to find the value of B and A, B, C is an isosceles triangle because B, C and B, A are congruent so we will discuss in triangle A, B, C, A, B is equal to BC so angle A will be equal to angle C and strength sum of acute angle in right angle triangle is equal to 90 degrees so I will apply the formula sum of acute angles acute angles is equal to 90 degree and acute angle is angle A and angle C, angle B and sorry angle A and angle C so angle A plus angle C will be equal to 90 degree and the value of angle A is B and angle C is congruent to angle A so here I will I write B as well is equal to 90 degree so B plus B mean 2B is equal to 90 degree and 2 is multiplying when we transfer it to the side it will divide so 90 over 2 means 45 so the value of angle B is 45 degree then C part there is a circle with center O and first I will name the points as A, B and C and we have to find the value of this C so students, first we will discuss triangle BOC that is equilateral triangles and all the sides are equal so all the angles will also be equal. Keep in mind students, triangle BOC is an equilateral triangle so all the angles are equal and they will be of 60 degree. So first I will write in triangle BOC OB is equal to OC is equal to BC so angle BOC will be equal to 
एंगल ओ सी बी दैट विल बी इक्वल टू एंगल सी बी ओ एंड स्टूडेंट्स नाउ सम ऑफ एंगल्स इन अ ट्रायंगल इज इक्वल टू 180 डिग्री सो वी विल सम अप ऑल द थ्री एंगल्स एंड फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस एंगल सो स्टूडेंट्स आई नेम इट एज एंगल ए सो स्टूडेंट्स हियर वी विल अप्लाई फार्मूला सम ऑफ एंगल्स इन ट्रायंगल इज इक्वल टू 180 डिग्री and angle boc is given the name as a and this angle boc is equal to angle ocb this will also be a and this angle will also be a that is equal to 180 degree so a plus a plus a means 3a is equal to 180 degree and 3 is multiplying when we transfer it to the side it will divide so 180 degree over 3 is equal to 60 degree so the value of a is 60 degree now students we will discuss triangle boa and triangle boa ob is equal to oa and the reason is radii of same circle so students angle a b o Will be equal to angle BAO. I mean to say, this angle and this angle will be equal, and sum of the interior angle is equal to exterior angle. So, students, we will apply the formula. Angle BOC is an exterior angle of this triangle. So, here I will apply a formula. Exterior angle is equal to sum of opposite. Interior angles. So, students, exterior angle is angle BOC is equal to interior angles are angle BAO plus angle ABO. Now, students, exterior angle is A and its value is 60 degrees. So, here I will write 60 degree is equal to angle BAO is C. Plus angle ABO will also be C because both angles are equal. So students, C plus C mean 2C. So 60 degree will be equal to 2C, and 2 is multiplying when we transfer it to the side. It will divide. So the value of C is 30 degree. So C is equal to 30 degree, and it is the C part of question number two. Students, D part is there is a circle with center O, and there are four points A, B, C, and D. A, B, C, and D, and we have to find this angle D. So, students, first we will discuss triangle O, C, B, in which O, A, and O, B are equal because we are in a sine circle. So, angle. This angle and this angle, I name it as angle E. Angle E and 30 degree both will be equal because opposite angles are congruent sides. So first we will discuss in triangle OCB. OC is equal to OB. Radii of same circle. So angle OCB will be equal to angle OBC. If angle OCB is 30 degree, then E will also be 30 degree. So 30 degree is equal to E, and angle E is equal to 30 degree. Now, students, we will find the value of this angle, and I can name it as an angle A. Now, students, in this triangle, sum of angles in a triangle is equal to 180 degree. So I will write sum of angles. In triangle is equal to 180 degree. So students, 30 degree plus the value of this angle E is also 30 degree, and A we have to find is equal to 180 degree. Now students, 30 plus 30 means 60 degree. 60 degree plus A is equal to 180 degree. 60 is plus on left side when we transfer it to the side it will become minus. And the value of A will become 120 degree. So the value of A is 120 degree. Now students, we will discuss triangle DOC in triangle DOC OD 
is equal to OC. Again, reason is radii of same circle. Radii of same circle. So, students, angle ODC will be equal to angle OCD. So, both angles will be equal to D. So, angle OCD will also be D. Now, students, this angle A is an exterior angle of triangle DOC because it is outside of the triangle. So, the sum of opposite interior angle is equal to exterior angle. Here, I will apply the formula. Exterior angle of a triangle is equal to sum of opposite interior angle. So, exterior angle of triangle is equal to sum of opposite interior angles. So, students, D, exterior angle is A, that will be equal to D plus angle OCD is equal to angle ODC, so it will also be D. And the value of A we have found it out that is 120 degree is equal to D plus D mean 2D and 2 is multiplying when we transfer it to the side it will divide. So 120 degree over 2 is equal to D and the value of D is 60 degree. Friends, question number 3 of the same exercise is in each of the case O is the center of the circle and find the value of unknown. First, students, I will name the points A, B, C, and D. Students, we will discuss triangle O, A, B, in which O, A, and O, B both are congruent because O is the center of the circle and O, A, and O, B are the radius of same circle. So, first, I will write in triangle O, A, B, it means that we are talking about triangle O, A, B. In which OA is equal to OB and reason is radii of same circle. So students, angle OAB will be equal to angle OBA because opposite angles of congruent sides. So angle OAB is X and the value of angle OBA is 50 degree. So the value of X is 50. Friends, B part of question number 3 is there is a circle and there are 4 cards. First I will name the points A, B, C and D and this angle is 100 degree and angle B is 68 degree. I name it as point X. So students, we have to find the value of Y. Students, just think carefully that suppose D, C, B, A is an arc of a circle and then angle C and angle B will be the circumangle because both are on the same arc. So angle C will be equal to angle B and the reason is both are circumangle of, a, uh, of an arc. So students first I will write angle C will be equal to angle B and the reason are both angles are both are circumangles on same arc. Students, both the angles, angle D, C, A and angle D, B, A are on the same arc. So, the value of both the angles is equal. So, angle C is equal to angle B. So, the value of angle C will be 68 degree. Now, students, we will discuss triangle D, C, X and I will write it as in triangle D, C, X. Sum of angles in a triangle, sum of angles in triangle is equal to 180 degree, so 100 degree plus the value of angle C is 68 degree plus Y we have to find is equal to 180 degree, 100 plus 68 means 168 degree plus Y is equal to 180 degree. 168 is plus on left side when we transfer it to other side it will become minus so y is equal to 180 degree minus 168 degree so subtract 168 from 180 and we will have 12 degree so the value of y is 12 degree 
So students, it's enough for today. May Allah Almighty bless you all the time and have a good day.